It's important because when George Floyd went down, the whole nation and the world rose up. He went down in hate, we're rising in love. He went down in injustice, we're rising up for justice. George Floyd died in discrimination, but the world now rises in equality. And when we now understand that when George Floyd goes down, all of us rise. Now it's our time to honor his life and his death by becoming one family with one future, and that's the movement that we're leading. And once again, we've seen that even though George Floyd was taken really from the, from the Floyd family here in the city of Houston, that we've all come together once again, Houston Strong, showing that when we work together and we work uh, in a manner and a spirit that is constructive and not destructive, that we can change the world. And I really believe that there's a great hope here in this city and we and that hope is spreading nationwide. This is a watershed moment. And if any city can lead with Mayor Turner here with this, you all know that he's a man of faith and this community can lead and set the way, this is the way forward and we, we're gonna see some meaningful change. I have one last question. Can I... So the president's messaging has been very bad for this country and his latest message in terms of bringing in the military to have what he calls law and order. We who have been in this movement as long as I under have, we understand that he means order and law. Order and law as opposed to law and order. Order and law means that you establish the order and I'll take care of you with the law. Uh, that's a bad message to send because that's how we get the George Floyds of the world when you get this kind of messaging. It's time for a change to come. I believe we're at that moment in time when it will become a movement and I believe we can make a difference.